I'm Linda Henley Smith. Okay, so here's the deal. Everybody wants to find some more joy in their lives, but these days it seems like there's so much negativity going around that it's hard to find it. So here are some tips on how to live with an attitude of altitude. First of all, this is something that I learned a long time ago. You can't change anybody else unless they're in diapers. So if you meet someone who disagrees with you, who is mean and snarky or posts something mean and nasty on social media, let it go. Move on. You have a choice on what you fill your head with, how much time you spend on negativity. So choose positivity. Do you remember in Toy Story, Mr. and Mrs. Potato Head, and Mrs. Potato Head said to her husband, I am packing your angry eyes just in case you need them. Well, you don't need those angry eyes. They say that your eyes are the windows into your soul. Well, for goodness sake, stay away from the nasty angry eyes. Choose joy. And it isn't being a Pollyanna. It's just fun. It's more fun to look for joy. There will be enough negative stuff that will find us anyway. So don't worry about spending a little extra time concentrating on what is right instead of what's wrong. Now, here is a tip for you. There are going to be people who are going to always want to bring positive people down. They're going to tell you everything that's wrong. Well, that's why I have my happy punchosaurus. And any time that anybody is deciding they're going to tell me everything that's wrong with the world, I can just kind of give them one of these. We sort of have the same smile, don't we? And that makes me laugh. It isn't for entertaining other people. It's just to remind myself that I have a choice. And you know what? Sometimes, well, like the other day, I was trying to find a parking place in a really busy parking lot. And of course, the classic thing happened where I waited and then a little car zoomed in in front of me. Well, it made me angry, but I thought, what am I going to gain by being angry? So just to entertain myself, I whipped out my troll poofing wand and to myself, I said, poof, you're gone. <laughs> it didn't do anything to that driver, but it sure made me feel better because I reminded myself that I am making a choice. When you wrench your brain out to negativity, it's hard to find joy. I'm going to be offering some more of these tips because, you know, we only have one life to live. So it's up to each one of us to decide what we do with it. So go get yourself some toys. Go out, have fun, find joy. Be more childlike. Follow a little child around. Make sure you know them before you follow them. But watch how they interact. And there's a sense of wonder. See if you could capture some of that again. And in the meantime, keep laughing. Thank you.